Hi, this is Chris Fanberg. And Brian Johnson. And we're going to specifically discuss with you, the coach, just as we are, why we are so enthusiastic about sharing body language with you. This is really the most valuable tool we have learned in all of our experience, which is how to both understand ourselves and our clients on a much deeper emotional level because all body language has a meaning. We've been doing this combined for over 40 years and worked with over 15,000 people and have been blessed with some amazing information and amazing stories of people reversing irre irre irreversible illnesses. And what we're specifically going to talk about is the thought patterns and all the symptoms that show up in the body and all the communication that's going on that you're completely unaware of until now. Personally connecting with your clients and understand emotionally what struggles that they're, they're dealing with is the best way to connect with your clients and help them overcome and achieve their goals in life is to help them deal with those past struggles by identifying what they're going through. So very simple, common body language techniques will help you reach your clients on a whole other level. Coming from a personal training background of working with over 15,000 people, what I found consistently was that I was amazing at personal training, which I'm sure you are too, and still I would have clients that were still having issues that I wasn't able to remedy. Since I found body language, now I understand what back issues are about, what kidney issues are about, what self-sabotage mechanisms are functioning in their mindset that keep creating the cyclical destructive patterns that they have. You can address uh, issues in multiple ways, but sometimes when they're having physical ailments, you know, as health coaches, we have learned to try to help and address some of these physical ailments nutritionally. But a lot of times that's not the issue. It's actually an emotional issue that's dealing with a physical ailment. And so if you're not addressing the emotional issues as well, you're missing out on half the boat. Yeah. So we're just enthusiastic about providing this opportunity for you to join us so we can share this information with you so you can maximize your ability to serve your clients and complete create a completely different way of servicing your clients where you don't even necessarily have to be in front of them doing one-on-one -on -one work. So remember, if you don't make time for your wellness, you will make time for your illness. Have a blessed day.